All right, so we're here with Hurricane at the Veterinary Surgical Center in Virginia. We're currently here today with Pauls of Honor, and we are meeting with Dr. Bronke, and we're gonna do some treatment on his hips. As you, as you guys know, uh, his hips are super bad. His back feet start to drag after a couple months without any treatment. So we come here, we get our injections, and wanna show you what it looks like firsthand. So, uh, Doc, can you tell us what we're gonna be doing today? Yeah, we're gonna get him all set, and we're gonna sedate him very lightly just so he stays nice and in one spot and we're going to inject both of his hip joints with a synthetic gel to get us some good lubrication in there get the awesome. guy feeling better yep so we always show you know what these heroes do while they're working but we also want to show how the heroes get treated in retirement so this is the stuff that uh, is super important so they can you know enjoy these golden years and and keep going you know gotta gotta return the favor they did it for us so we're going to make sure they're happy in retirement and as you can tell this guy's definitely happy <laughs> So Marshall, what we're going to look at is we've got Hurricane's hip x-rays pulled up and I figured we can kind of go over them a little bit so we know what we're going to get done with today. Okay. With Hurricane, what we see on both sides is that the ball doesn't fit quite into the socket as well. Yeah. And he's got some bone spurs or osteophytes or arthritis all around this hip joint. And then on the other side, it's a little bit better on x-ray. Um, he's got a little bit deeper socket here but he's still got some bone spurs all around the edges and stuff and a little flat there. Yeah. So what we'll do today is I'm gonna, we're gonna sedate him and I'm gonna put a needle directly into that hip joint. I'm gonna pull out that excess fluid and we're gonna put in a synthetic gel and that's gonna go all around this joint space and it's gonna fill in all the little nooks and crannies that's the irritated joint capsule. Okay. It'll go in there, it'll take about two weeks to kind of set up shop. We've used it on a number of dogs in the Europe and here in the US. I think it's gonna give us a good shot to get him comfortable. And we'll do that for both of his hip joints. Good spot, Kim, ready to go? Leslie poking. So here's our joint fluid. And sometimes we get out a lot, sometimes we get out a little. Just being patient and seeing how much we can get out of there. We're not gonna empty it all out, we're just taking what he'll give us to get some extra off of there, so it's a little gooey, okay? But it's not very, it's kind of watery, right? We got out just under an ML. And now we're gonna inject this whole syringe directly in. And I'm gonna pull that out and we're just gonna run that joint through a little bit of a range of motion just to distribute that gel in there. Okay. Oh yeah. And that's it. So let's recap a bit. All right. All right. He did really well through his sedation. He's just coming up now. Okay. We injected each hip with the cinnamid or arthromid gel to get some coating and viscosity and some pain relief into those worn out hips of his, those arthritic hips. He's going to be able to stand up here in a little few minutes. Doesn't sound go. like it. <laughs> he might want to sleep this off for a bit, but he'll be able to stand in a little while and hopefully here over the next... Yep. Week to two, three weeks, we start to see a good improvement in his mobility. Okay, so I should, uh, about a week, and I'll start the... To... Solid, the cortisone will take effect within the next three to five days. Okay. And, but the hips will take a little bit longer. Okay. But get him comfortable and uh, keep him moving. Awesome, thank you, Doc. This is, this is what keeps him going, so, yeah. Keep prolonging his, his life as much as we can, or at least a comfortable life. So, after we do this, he's, he's good for a couple months. Exactly. Maybe even longer, we'll see. Yeah. 
quality is always great with him. His liver and kidney function tests all came up fantastic today. Okay. He looks good. I'm really happy. All right. All right. Thank you. My pleasure, sir. Thank you. Appreciate it. Yeah.